guys welcome back to my channel so as you could tell by the title we are doing a self-care day it is very much so needed for me and we are starting off with the hair care so I'm just taking my hair out of the ponytail I had and I'm oiling my scalp I am using the Mio Rosemary the mint one I believe I love this stuff so freaking much and then I'm going in with the long hair growth serum or oil I believe I forgot what it's called but it's in this yellow bottle and I have been using this for years um, I've been very into, you know, very uh, nourishing my scalp, if you say. I am on my long hair journey, so I just want to take care of my hair as much as possible, you know. And I really believe my hair has been growing because I oil my scalp all the time and I'm always massaging it. But yeah, I'm just taking down this hairstyle because I do want to do a hair mask on my hair. So yeah, I just got back from the gym and yeah, I really need to wash my hair because she do be getting dirty very quick because of the gym. But I'm just wetting my hair just to get it ready for the hair mask. And the hair mask we are using today is the Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Condition by Shea Moisture, which this hair, this is the only thing I use by Shea Moisture. Um, I love this line of their products. And yeah, this one just doesn't do me wrong. And yeah, I'm gonna just let that sit in my hair until I wash it out later. But we're just gonna get ready for our little bath time. And I am pouring this Dr. Teal's Eucalyptus and Spearmint into my bath. I am very sore, my muscles are tired from the gym. So I wanted to use this scent, you know, for it to be very relaxing. And it does say it helps with muscle soreness, muscle pains, all that. And I did sprinkle in the bath salts that goes with this soap. However, I think I lost the clip because it just wasn't in here. And then I'm just going to put in a bath bomb, the coconut and warm and vanilla. And you're going to see that I love this scent so much. But I'm just getting my little bath ready and all that, lighting a candle in that same scent. Oh, I love the coconut and warm vanilla. It smells so good. And then we're just going to put on a face mask by Lancome. And yeah, now I wasn't going to include this next clip <laughs> because I just look so freaking crazy. Like who lays like that in the bathtub? <laughs> but just know I was so freaking comfortable. And then I'm just reading my book. It starts with us. I'm ready to finish it already. I need to hurry up and finish it. Next, we're just going to exfoliate our legs. Um, my legs need to be shaved really bad. I luckily do not grow hair that fast, so it takes me a while to have to shave my legs, but today was a day that we're shaving them. And I just used this brush, and I'm not going to lie, it kind of hurts. It kind of hurts, however, I feel like it really exfoliated my legs. And if you, have, if you have not used this shaving oil by Tree Hut, specifically in Moroccan Rose, you need to. When I tell you this stuff smells so freaking good and the glide on my legs for the shaving, oh my gosh, it felt so good. And it left my legs just so soft, you know, because it's an oil and all that. So I just used that. And yeah, next we're just going to rinse out that hair mask we had on our head and then I'm going to condition my hair with the TPH hairline, which is Taraji P. Hansen, which I have made a video with all these products and I really love how the video came out. So I'm also going to include in this video because it was some, it took some time. It was hard work and I am very very proud of it so y'all are about to see that right now i'm going to take you out through a wash day using tph hair so i first like to start off with the master cleanse and i love this so much because it really does cleanse your scalp 
and will have it feeling so tingly and then I just follow up with a mint conditioner and I just also put this throughout the scalp just so I can um, add back moisture and I also brush it through so that it coats everything and I also like it because it promotes hair growth as well and then to add in even more moisture because I do have curly hair I just go in with her conditioner and once again I just brush it throughout and before I style my hair I do like to spray in this leave-in detangler that she has and then yeah this is the final product after styling my hair as usual so yeah hope you enjoy was that not a great video like i hope y'all see my hard work work i put into it but next we're just going to get into the skincare which i've talked previously about my skincare routine in a past video i'll just put it in a card in the corner but i'm just using the la roche posay the facial moisturizer and the face wash now I'm not gonna lie, I started using normal to dry skin products because I felt like it just helped my skin so much from being oily, if that makes sense. I don't know, it makes sense to me. But while we're on the topic of moisturizing, I am using the same coconut and warm vanilla on my body. So we're just gonna moisturize our legs and our whole body. Do not forget the toes. Please do not walk around here, even though the toes are covered because it's winter time. Do not walk around here with some ashy feet. We don't like cracked, chapped feet. And like I said, moisturize your whole body. It's self-care. It feels so freaking good. And don't, even the areas you can't see. So yes, moisturize your butt, your back. We don't want dry skin. Then we're just gonna get into some teeth whitening. Now I've never tried this before, um, but I wanted to try it out for the sake of this video. So it's by Arc, and you just apply it to this little thing that they give you. And it says you can use it like four times a day. Um, so we're gonna try it out. And if I like it, I'll continue to use it. I don't like the Crest white strips because those make my teeth so, so sensitive and I hate having sensitive teeth. I actually just got over my sensitive teeth. I had to start using Sensodyne again. I don't know what, but my my teeth just got sensitive out of nowhere. And yeah, I just had to go back to my handy dandy Sensodyne. And now my teeth are better. I don't want to go back to sensitive teeth no more. But lastly, we're just going to get ready for bed. And I before bre bed, not bread, before bed, I spray this Dr. Teal's melatonin spray on my bed. And oh, it just provides me with such a good sleep. It smells so freaking good. And yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this little video. Okay, so it is later. I styled my hair and everything off camera. I do have a whole curly hair routine on my channel. If y'all do want to watch that, I will put that in the cards or whatever. Um, but that is the end of this video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Love y'all.